Hello and welcome to the Slingshot channel. Today we want to look at steel darts again. Those are really fun and I managed to get some really cheap. They even bear the American flag. <laughs> and of course they're made to be thrown and that works. Nice. Now of course if you throw them they are normally not very fast. But I think that if you really want to throw them hard, it could be a good idea to just accelerate them with the tip of your finger, like this, so that you have a larger arc, like this. I've been looking at websites that talk about how you really throw stuff, and I found the Adel Adel, um, or Adel Adel, I don't know how it's pronounced. Um, this is actually like a spear thrower that lengthens your arm. I took that idea, it made the world's first dart thrower at Laddle. <laughs> Let me show you its features. So you put the dart in here and when you throw you actually lift it up so it lengthens your arm and your finger and then of course you have more speed for the throw. Oh. I really like my new at Laddle <laughs> for darts. But this would not be the Slingshot channel if you would not take that idea and make something really ridiculous about it. My idea is to take a clothespin like this that can hold the dart just like a man can and then throw it simply by releasing the uh, clothespin at the right moment, like this. Oops. <coughs> to you the world's first drill-powered, fully automatic dart launcher. <laughs> Let me show you its features. As you see, it clamps a dart in a clothespin that I had to strengthen a little bit with additional rubber, what else? Just so that it has enough pressure. It is operated by a regular drill. Now, in order to fire them. Of course you need to press on the clothespin lever here. And this is done with this lever contraption. So when you pull this from here the lever presses against the clothespins um, as they pass and so if you pull then you fire, when you stop then you release like this. Okay let's try it. It works! <laughs> it's not very accurate, but you have to admit it works. It's quite some penetration. All right, one more try. And fire! <laughs> <laughs> pray and pray. So far we've been shooting with the weakest uh, power position of this uh, drill because if you shoot them too fast they break because they're simply not made for that kind of impact. But we can screw it up and just see how much stronger it can get. Okay. Wow! <laughs> Some hit really high. Most of them are on target. And of course the penetration is maximum. They just went into the hilt. And as you can see the clothes pins are not made for that kind of uh, stress. So they break off and need a replacement. By the way, when building such a device, you have to be very careful because some of the test shots can be really strange. I'm running a contest on the forum. You can win something. I can't talk about that here on YouTube because it's against the rules. But if you want to participate, you find the link to my forum right in the text description. So, I hope you like this because... That's it for today. <laughs> Thanks and bye-bye.